What's up, Rooted? Today I'm going to show you guys how to beat boredom with two simple and easy to make Play-Doh recipes. They use ingredients you can find right in your kitchen. Let's get started. Alright guys, our two recipes today are going to include some cornstarch and conditioner, or some hand soap, or dish soap, and flour. Feel free to mix and match depending on what you guys have in your kitchen. To kick things off, we're going to start with the flour and soap dough. For this recipe, we're going to need some flour, some dish soap, and a couple measuring utensils. We're going to start with a half cup of flour. Feel free to dump that right into your bowl. And to that, we're going to add a quarter cup of hand soap. Feel free to mix that up. It'll only take a few seconds for the dough to come together. Add more soap if needed, and it should be forming the consistency of Play-Doh. This needs a little color. I'm gonna go for green. The more you mix it, the more it'll come together. This is coming together great, but I think I added the food coloring too late. It's not looking quite right. I think I'm gonna need to try again. So like the first time, we're going to add half a cup of flour. But this time, we're going to put the food coloring in with our dish soap and mix the wet ingredients together. This way the consistency should be better. Add just a little bit more flour, but the color is definitely right. Make sure you keep mixing until all the flour is dissolved. This is much better than the last time. There we have it, you guys. Here's our dish soap and flour dough. Now on to the next. 
batch, we're doing the cornstarch and conditioner mix. It's going to be the same measurements as last time, with half a cup of cornstarch and a quarter cup of the conditioner. Any brand of conditioner works. I just grabbed what was in my shower. Try to remember to mix the food coloring in with the red ingredients. I remember just in the nick of time. I found this dough to be a lot more fun to mix. It was almost fluffy. Cornstarch is a thickening agent, so you could probably use flour in this recipe as well. Keep mixing until it starts to form the consistency of Play-Doh. This dough is definitely way more sticky, so don't be shy with the cornstarch. Once it comes together, it should feel kind of silky. And there you have it. Some behind the scenes action going on, keeping our station nice and clean. As you guys can see here, the conditioner dough is way smoother than the hand soap dough. And I think that's because of the cornstarch too. Let's check out the flour. This one feels a little bit lumpy, but this definitely has more of the texture of Play-Doh than the conditioner dough does. And it's a little stretchier. I found after letting them sit for a while too that the flour and hand soap dough held up way better. Both these doughs were super fun to make and super easy as well. Feel free to experiment with different ingredients and different measurements too. much for watching everybody. I really hope you enjoyed the video. Stay well and I will see you guys next time.